In this video, we will connect and configure GitHub tool with ServiceNow DevOps Change Velocity. DevOps Change Velocity application connects data from various DevOps tool chain, which includes GitHub and GitHub Enterprise. Once connected to the GitHub tool, additional settings can be configured to enable DevOps to import work items, code commits, pipelines, and insert into the DevOps data model. To create a tool connection, navigate to DevOps Change Workspace. Here you can create a tool connection using the connect tool widget or tools module. We will create the tool connection using the connect tools widget. Here you can select the GitHub from either orchestration or plan or code categories. Let's select the GitHub here and input the preferred tool name. We have various authentication methods supported for connecting the GitHub tool. One is basic auth, other is OAuth with authorization code and JWT, JSON Web Token. Let's select OAuth with JWT. And this provides an option to use an existing JWT credential record or create a new credential record. We will look at creating the GitHub app in a separate video. In this video, let's assume the GitHub app has been set up already and its credential record is created in ServiceNow credentials. So let's choose existing credential record and input the GitHub app name and proceed further. Now the permission checks are done for the credential we have selected, which ensures a seamless discovery and import of tool objects. If there are any failures in this permission check, provide the required permissions as documented in the GitHub app for this tool creation. In this example, all the permission checks are successful. So let's proceed further. Now let's specify the tool access. We will restrict access to the tool, adding the groups that must have access in the maintained by field. We will also click the checkbox. All DevOps app owners can view and associate tool objects to applications. For now, we will skip this option and proceed. Now we will configure the GitHub tool to automatically send data to ServiceNow DevOps Change Velocity application. We can select the repositories we want to configure webhooks. We could also prefer to configure the webhooks manually as well later using the option configure manually. This option usually is chosen when there are restrictions in an organization to allow automatic configuration due to the ServiceNow admin and tool admins in an organization might be different personas. Let me now select this repository to configure the webhooks. This will enable the GitHub tool to send real-time notifications for commits, work items, pipelines, and workflows from GitHub Actions, making it easier to maintain up-to-date information. Now the GitHub tool is connected and configured successfully with ServiceNow DevOps Change Velocity. The next step is you can associate the objects discovered for this tool, such as work items, commits, pipelines, to an existing application or a new application. Let's quickly take a look at the tool record which got created. So it's all connected successfully. And these are all the various tool objects which has been created, plans, repositories, and pipelines. So with this, we complete the demo of GitHub connection and configuration. 